valproate (VPA) and its valproic acid, sodium valproate, and valproate semisodium forms, are medications primarily used to treat epilepsy and bipolar disorder and to prevent migraine headaches. They are useful for the prevention of seizures in those with absent seizures, partial seizures, and generalized seizures. They can be given intravenously or by mouth. Long and short-acting formulations of tablets exist. Common side effects include nausea, vomiting, sleepiness, and a dry mouth. Serious side effects can include liver problems and regular monitoring of liver function tests is therefore recommended. Other serious risks include pancreatitis and an increased suicide risk. The drug is known to cause serious abnormalities in the baby if taken during pregnancy. Because of this it is not typically recommended in women of childbearing age who have migraines, it is unclear exactly how valproate works. Proposed mechanisms include affecting GABA levels, blocking voltage-gated sodium channels, and inhibiting histone deacetylases. Valproic acid is a branched short-chain fatty acid SCFA, made from valeric acid. Valproate was first made in 1881 and came into medical use in 1962. Valproate is included in the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines, the most effective and safe medicines needed in a health system. It is available as a generic medication. The wholesale cost in the developing world is between 0.14 and 52 United States cents per day. In the United States, it costs roughly 90 cents USD per day. It is marketed under the brand names Depakot and Epilim, among others. Terminology Valproic acid BPA, is an organic weak acid. The conjugate base is valproate. The sodium salt of the acid is sodium valproate and a coordination complex of the two is known as valproate semisodium. Medical uses It is used primarily to treat epilepsy and bipolar disorder. It is also used to prevent migraine headaches. Epilepsy Valproate has a broad spectrum of anticonvulsant activity, although it is primarily used as a first-line treatment for tonic-clonic seizures, absence seizures and myoclonic seizures and as a second-line treatment for partial seizures and infantile spasms. It has also been successfully given intravenously to treat status epilepticus. Mental illness Bipolar disorder Valproate products are also used to treat manic or mixed episodes of bipolar disorder. Schizophrenia A 2016 systematic review compared the efficacy of valproate as an add-on for people with schizophrenia. Dopamine dysregulation syndrome Based upon five case reports, valproic acid may have efficacy in controlling the symptoms of the dopamine dysregulation syndrome that arise from the treatment of Parkinson's disease with levodopa. Migraines Valproate is also used to prevent migraine headaches. Because this medication can be potentially harmful to the fetus, valproate should be considered for those able to become pregnant only after the risks have been discussed. Other The medication has been tested in the treatment of AIDS and cancer, owing to its histone deacetylase inhibiting effects. Adverse effects Valproic acid has a black box warning for hepatotoxicity, pancreatitis, and fetal abnormalities. Other possible side effects there is evidence that valproic acid may cause premature growth plate ossification in children and adolescents, resulting in decreased height. Valproic acid can also cause mydriasis, a dilation of the pupils. There is evidence that shows valproic acid may increase the chance of polycystic ovary syndrome PCOS, in women with epilepsy or bipolar disorder. Studies have shown this risk of PCOS is higher in women with epilepsy compared to those with bipolar disorder. Weight gain is also possible. Pregnancy 
Valproate causes birth defects. Exposure during pregnancy is associated with about three times as many major abnormalities as usual, mainly spina bifida, with the risks being related to the strength of medication used and use of more than one drug. More rarely, with several other defects, including a valproate syndrome. Characteristics of this valproate syndrome include facial features that tend to evolve with age, including a triangle-shaped forehead, tall forehead with bifrontal narrowing, epiconthic folds, medial deficiency of eyebrows, flat nasal bridge, broad nasal root, antiverted nares, shallow philtrum, long upper lip and thin vermilion borders, thick lower lip and small downturned mouth. While developmental delay is usually associated with altered physical characteristics, dysmorphic features, this is not always the case. Children of mothers taking valproate during pregnancy are at risk for lower IQs. Maternal valproate use during pregnancy has been associated with a significantly higher probability of autism in the offspring. A 2005 study found rates of autism among children exposed to sodium valproate before birth in the cohort studied were 8.9%. The normal incidence for autism in the general population is estimated at less than 1%. A 2009 study found that the three-year-old children of pregnant women taking valproate had an IQ 9 points lower than that of a well-matched control group. However, further research in older children and adults is needed. Sodium valproate has been associated with a rare condition paroxysmal tonic upgaze of childhood, also known as ovrier bilson syndrome, from childhood or fetal exposure. This condition resolved after discontinuing valproate therapy. Women who intend to become pregnant should switch to a different medication if possible, or decrease their dose of valproate. Women who become pregnant while taking valproate should be warned that it causes birth defects and cognitive impairment in the newborn, especially at high doses. Although valproate is sometimes the only drug that can control seizures, and seizures in pregnancy could have even worse consequences, studies have shown that taking folic acid can reduce the risk of congenital neural tube defects. Elderly Valproate in elderly people with dementia caused increased sleepiness. More people stopped the medication for this reason. Additional side effects of weight loss and decreased food intake was also associated in one half of people who become sleepy. Contraindications Contraindications include Pre-existing acute or chronic liver dysfunction or family history of severe liver inflammation, hepatitis, particularly medicine-related. Known hypersensitivity to valproate or any of the ingredients used in the preparation Urea cycle disorders Hepatic porphyria Hepatotoxicity Mitochondrial disease Pancreatitis Porphyria Interactions Valproate inhibits CYP2C9, glucuronyl transferase, and epoxide hydrolase and is highly protein-bound and hence may interact with drugs that are substrates for any of these enzymes or are highly protein-bound themselves. It may also potentiate the CNS depressant effects of alcohol. It should not be given in conjunction with other antiepileptics due to the potential for reduced clearance of other antiepileptics including carbamazepine, lamotrigine, phenytoin and phenobarbitone, and itself. It may also interact with aspirin, may increase valproate concentrations. May also interfere with valproate's metabolism. Benzodiazepines, may cause CNS depression and there are possible pharmacokinetic interactions. Carbapenem antibiotics, reduces valproate levels, potentially leading to seizures. Cimetidine, inhibits valproate's metabolism in the liver, leading to increased valproate concentrations. Erythromycin, inhibits valproate's metabolism in the liver, leading to increased valproate concentrations. Ethosuximide, may increase ethosuximide concentrations and lead to toxicity. Felbamate, may increase plasma concentrations of valproate. Mefloquine, may increase valproate metabolism combined with the direct epileptogenic effects of mefloquine. Oral contraceptives, may reduce plasma concentrations of valproate. 
Primidone may accelerate metabolism of valproate, leading to a decline of serum levels and potential breakthrough seizure. Rifampin increases the clearance of valproate, leading to decreased valproate concentrations. Warfarin may increase warfarin concentration and prolong bleeding time. Zidovudine may increase zidovudine serum concentration and lead to toxicity. Overdose and toxicity Excessive amounts of valproic acid can result in sleepiness, tremor, stupor, respiratory depression, coma, metabolic acidosis, and death. In general, serum or plasma valproic acid concentrations are in a range of 20 to 100 mg L during controlled therapy, but may reach 150 to 1,500 mg L following acute poisoning. Monitoring of the serum level is often accomplished using commercial immunoassay techniques, although some laboratories employ gas or liquid chromatography. In contrast to other antiepileptic drugs, at present there is little favorable evidence for salivary therapeutic drug monitoring. Salivary levels of valproic acid correlate poorly with serum levels, partly due to valproate's weak acid property, pKa of 4.9. In severe intoxication, hemoperfusion or hemofiltration can be an effective means of hastening elimination of the drug from the body. Supportive therapy should be given to all patients experiencing an overdose and urine output should be monitored. Supplemental L-carnitine is indicated in patients having an acute overdose and also prophylactically in high-risk patients. Acetyl L-carnitine lowers hyperaminemia less markedly than L-carnitine. Pharmacology Pharmacodynamics Although the mechanism of action of valproate is not fully understood, traditionally, its anticonvulsant effect has been attributed to the blockade of voltage-gated sodium channels and increased brain levels of gamma-aminobutyric acid, GABA. The GABAergic effect is also believed to contribute towards the anti-manic properties of valproate. In animals, sodium valproate raises cerebral and cerebellar levels of the inhibitory synaptic neurotransmitter, GABA, possibly by inhibiting GABA degradative enzymes, such as GABA transaminase, succinate semialdehyde dehydrogenase and by inhibiting the re-uptake of GABA by neuronal cells, prevention of neurotransmitter-induced hyperexcitability of nerve cells, via KV7.2 channel and aka P5, may also contribute to its mechanism. Also, it has been shown to protect against a seizure-induced reduction in phosphatidylinositol 3, 4, 5, trisphosphate, PIP3, as a potential therapeutic mechanism. It also has histone deacetylase inhibiting effects. The inhibition of histone deacetylase, by promoting more transcriptionally active chromatin structures, likely presents the epigenetic mechanism for regulation of many of the neuroprotective effects attributed to valproic acid. Intermediate molecules mediating these effects include VEGF, VDNF, and GDNF. Endocrine actions Valproic acid has been found to be an antagonist of the androgen and progesterone receptors, and hence is a nonsteroidal antiandrogen and antiprogestogen, at concentrations much lower than therapeutic serum levels. In addition, the drug has been identified as a potent aromatase inhibitor, and suppresses estrogen concentrations. These actions are likely to be involved in the reproductive endocrine disturbances seen with valproic acid treatment. Valproic acid has been found to directly stimulate androgen biosynthesis in the gonads via inhibition of histone deacetylases and has been associated with hyperandrogenism in women and increased 4-androstenedione levels in men. High rates of polycystic ovary syndrome and menstrual disorders have also been observed in women treated with valproic acid. Pharmacokinetics Metabolism The vast majority of valproate metabolism occurs in the liver. In adult patients taking valproate alone, 30-50% of an administered dose is excreted in urine as a glucuronide conjugate. The other major pathway in the metabolism of valproate is mitochondrial beta-oxidation, which typically accounts for over 40% of an administered dose. Typically, less than 20% of an administered dose is eliminated by other oxidative mechanisms. 
Less than 3% of an administered dose of valproate is excreted unchanged, i.e., as valproate in urine, valproate is known to be metabolized by the cytochrome P450 enzymes, CYP2A6, CYP2B6, CYP2C9, and CYP3A5. It is also known to be metabolized by the UDP transferase enzymes, UGT1A3, UGT1A4, UGT1A6, UGT1A8, UGT1A9, UGT1A10, UGT2B7, and UGT2B15. Some of the known metabolites of valproate by these enzymes and uncharacterized enzymes include 2-eme valproic acid, 3-z-eme valproic acid, 3-e-eme valproic acid, 4-eme valproic acid, valproic acid beta-O-glucoronide, 3-oxovalproic acid, 3-hydroxyvalproic acid, 4-hydroxyvalproic acid, 5-hydroxyvalproic acid, and valproyl-CoA, among others. Chemistry Valproic acid is a branched short-chain fatty acid and a derivative of valeric acid. History Valproic acid was first synthesized in 1882 by Beverly S. Burton as an analog of valeric acid, found naturally in valerian. Valproic acid is a carboxylic acid, a clear liquid at room temperature. For many decades, its only use was in laboratories as a metabolically inert solvent for organic compounds. In 1962, the French researcher Pierre Aymard serendipitously discovered the anticonvulsant properties of valproic acid while using it as a vehicle for a number of other compounds that were being screened for anti-seizure activity. He found it prevented pentylenetetrazole-induced convulsions in laboratory rats. It was approved as an antiepileptic drug in 1967 in France and has become the most widely prescribed antiepileptic drug worldwide. Valproic acid has also been used for migraine prophylaxis and bipolar disorder. Society and culture Cost It is available as a generic medication. The wholesale cost in the developing world is between 14 cents and 52 cents USD per day. In the European Union, end-user costs are less than 60 euro cents for an average daily dose in Germany. In the United States, it costs about 90 cents USD per day. Approval status Off-label uses in 2012, pharmaceutical company Abbott paid $1.6 billion in fines to federal and state governments for illegal promotion of off-label uses for Depakot, including the sedation of elderly nursing home residents. Formulations Valproate exists in two main molecular variants, sodium valproate and valproic acid without sodium, often implied by simply valproate. A mixture between these two is termed semisodium valproate. It is unclear whether there is any difference in efficacy between these variants, except from the fact that about 10% more of sodium valproate is needed than valproic acid without sodium to compensate for the sodium itself. Brand names of valproic acid Branded products include Brand names of sodium valproate Portugal Tablets, Diplexal R by Beale United States Intravenous Injection, Depakon by Abbott Laboratories Syrup, Depakine by Abbott Laboratories, Note Depakine capsules are valproic acid Depakot tablets are a mixture of sodium valproate and valproic acid Tablets, Eliaxum by Beale. Australia. Epilum crushable tablets Sanofi. Epilum sugar free liquid Sanofi. Epilum syrup Sanofi. Epilum tablets Sanofi. Sodium valproate Sandoz tablets Sanofi. Valpro tablets Alpha Farm. Valproate Winthrop Tablets Sanofi Valpreis Tablets Sigma
New Zealand Epilum by Sanofi Aventazol The above formulations are Pharmac subsidized. UK Depakot tablets, as in USA Tablets, Orlip by Wachhart and Epilum by Sanofi Oral solution, Orlip sugar-free by Wachhart and Epilum by Sanofi Syrup, Epilum by Sanofi Aventus Intravenous injection, Epilum intravenous by Sanofi Extended release tablets, Epilum Chrono by Sanofi is a combination of sodium valproate and valproic acid in a 2.3,1 ratio. Enteric coated tablets, Epilum EC200 by Sanofi is a 200 mg sodium valproate enteric coated tablet. UK only. Capsules, Epizenta prolonged release by Beacon. Sachets, Epizenta, prolonged release by Beacon Intravenous solution for injection, Epizenta solution for injection by Beacon Germany, Switzerland, Norway, Finland, Sweden Tablets, Orphiral by Desidin Pharmaceuticals Intravenous injection, Orphiral IV by Desidin Pharmaceuticals South Africa Syrup Convulix by BYK Madoss Tablets, Epilum by Sanofi Synthalabo Malaysia Tablets, Epilum by Sanofi Aventus Romania Companies are Sanofi Aventus France, GERTPHARMAZEUTIKAGMBH and Desidin ARZNEIMITTEL GMBH. Types are syrup. Extended release mini tablets, gastric resistant coated tablets, gastric resistant soft capsules, extended release capsules, extended release tablets, and extended release coated tablets. Canada Intravenous injection, Epibol or Epiject by Abbott Laboratories. Syrup, Dipakine by Abbott Laboratories. Its generic formulations include Apovalproic and Ratiovalproic. Japan Tablets, Dipakine by Kyoa Hako Kirin. Extended release tablets, Dipakine R by Kyoa Hako Kogyo and Selenica R by Koa. Syrup de Pekin by Kyoa Hako Kogyo. Europe In much of Europe, Depakin and Depakine Chrono tablets are equivalent to Epilum and Epilum Chrono above. Taiwan Tablets, White Round Tablet, Depakine, Chinese, Di Ba Dian Pinyin, Di Ba Dian, by Sanofi Winthrop Industry, France. Israel Depalipt and Depalipt Chrono, extended release tablets, are equivalent to Epilum and Epilum Chrono above. Manufactured and distributed by Sanofi Aventus. India, Russia and CIS countries. Valprol CR by Intus Pharmaceutical, India. Incorate Chrono by Sun Pharmaceutical, India. Servan Chrono by Levin APL Biotech, India. Brand names of Valproate Semisodium Brazil – Depakot by Abbott Laboratories and Torval CR by Torrent do Brazil Canada – Epibol by Abbott Laboratories Mexico – Epibol and Epibol ER extended release by Abbott Laboratories United Kingdom – Depakot for psychiatric conditions and Epilum for epilepsy by Sanofi Aventus and Generics United States – Depakot and depakot -er, extended release by Abbott Laboratories and Generics India – Valence and Valence OD by Abbott Healthcare Private Limited, Devalider by Linux Laboratories Private Limited, Valixer by Sigmund Prometica, Decorate by Sun Pharma Germany – Ergonal Chrono by Sanofi Aventus and Generics Chile – Valcode and Valcoder by Abbott Laboratories 
France and other European countries Depakot Peru – Devalprax by AC Pharma Laboratories China – Deprade O.D. References Further reading Chateauvieux S., Marceau F., Decado M., Diederich M. 2010. Molecular and Therapeutic Potential and Toxicity of Valproic Acid. PDF. J. Biomed. Biotechnal, 2010-1-18. doi 10.1155, 2010 PMC 2926634. PMID 20,798,865. Monty B., Polazi E., Contestabile A. 2009. Biochemical, Molecular and Epigenetic Mechanisms of Valproic Acid Neuroprotection. PDF. Kerr Mole Pharmacal, 2, 1, 95 109. Doi 10.2174 1 quintillion 874 quadrillion 467 trillion 210 billion 902 million 10,095. PMID 20 million 21,450. External links. Psych education Valproate Devalproix Devalproix. The Comparative Toxicogenomics Database, Valproic Acid Chemical Land 21, Valproic Acid RxList.com, Dipakine, Valproic Acid, U.S. South African Electronic Package Inserts, Convulix Med Broadcast. Com, Valproic Acid, Canadian.